the calcium scoring study is of the heart and it's to look at the um, arteries that feed the heart. So what we do is we do a CAT scan or CT. Um, it's fairly quick, takes about maybe 10, 15 minutes max. So when the patient comes into our CT room, they'll lay on the table. Um, we hook up a couple of EKG um, leads um, on three different areas there. And what that does is it monitors their heart rate. So you can see their heart rate um, and that those uh, numbers uh, sync to the CT scanner. So as we're scanning, the machine knows to take images when the heart rate is at its lowest so that we can get as least amount of motion as possible. So the patient is on the table, their arms are above their head, the table moves in and out a couple different times, it tells them to stop breathing for just a few seconds, take a couple images just strictly through the heart, the patient gets to leave. That's all there is for the patient. So once they leave, um, then we go back and do some more images on the computer and what we do is we look to see um, those four vessels that are actually feeding the heart, um, like the, um, the coronary arteries, and then we look to see if there's calcium in those. And the calcium, is, or plaque, is what uh, would be considered uh, detrimental to the patient. You know, that's what's going to give them the heart attack or the stroke. It will assign a number to those vessels if the plaque is, if there isn't any or if it gets higher and it has a particular number. And so that's why it's a scoring. 